Oscorp's modified CPF-1. Definitely Devil's Breath. Should be able to track the dispersal path now. The trail goes in a few directions. Need to find the right one. How long is it going to be closed for? Really can't say, sir. No good. Dead end. Vapor trail heads up that building. leads down into those vents. What was Otto doing up here? There should be a door or an access hatch around here. Well, this is moody. There must be some way to hit the lights. There be light. Whoa. Was Otto using this as a staging ground? Chaos of the prison break would have been perfect cover to move in. Norman. I feel like I can't turn around without seeing his face. He smiles for the cameras, collects his accolades, and keeps his boot heel pressed against my neck. Why can't anyone else see how selfish he is? How reckless? How... Evil! If only they could be made to see the... Looks like Otto's been studying Sable's tech for weaknesses. Good old Rhino. My second favorite Russian. Looks like Otto recorded messages for his crew. I've followed your career with great interest. The world sees you as a witless dullard. I see a warrior with a poet's heart. I know you desire freedom from the battle suit you're sealed inside. Help me achieve my goal. Mac Gargan, aka Scorpion, aka Crazy Pants McCrazy. It's rare for me to admit this, Mr. Gargan. Clearing your debts was more difficult than I anticipated. You're in arrears to some demanding individuals. But once the reservoir job is finished, your financial obligations will be finished as well. Otto Octavius is nothing if not persuasive. Otto's rage is driving him. The neural interface is exacerbating it, but his hate is genuine. He'll destroy the whole city to hurt Norman. Whew. 
Martin Lee. Can't believe this is the same man I knew at Feast. Oh, Martin. When I first realized it was you targeting Osborne these past weeks, I was shocked and saddened. But then, as the situation evolved before my eyes, I felt inspired. You took the bold steps I always dreamed of, Martin. Electro. Total live wire, that one. Max, when you first conveyed your dream to me, I thought you insane. Pure energy. <laughs> but as I dove deeper into the problem, I discovered a way to give us both what we desire. I promise you, when we are done, you will be pure energy. Or so close to it as to make the difference irrelevant. Old man Vulture. I've tangled with him more than anyone else here. Adrian, what bitter irony that your miraculous wings should have brought such horrors on your body. Thankfully, you are now working for me. When our work is settled, the treatment I've developed will cure you. You won't shuffle off this mortal coil just yet, my friend. 